mode, episode number 7 today for the British Grand Prix and as you can tell we are starting from pole position. Now the pit strategy is going to be the um, the one stop on the medium to the softs but let's go into the, onto the race and we've also, like I said in the last video we do have a new livery for this race so let's start the race. We go then to five red lights to the British Grand Prix. It's lights out and away we go and it's not a bad start for us off the line off, as, as we go into, into Abbey for the first time. So far we are in the lead from pole position. Bearing in mind qualifying was in the wet like, like in Austria. So I wasn't expecting much from that qualifying session, but apparently I know the um, but I know Silverson so well that I managed to pick the correct lines in the wet and um, I got full position. As you guys might know, I've actually been here before. If you do not lift off, then you might you might actually come off the circuit, but luckily um, we didn't go too far off, and um, we seem to be going too far off this time, as we go off wide and uh, Hamilton takes a lead from us, but we, do, we are going to try and of course try and get him back to that. We 
last time we packed some tomatoes, so maybe if we can, maybe we get to go down the inside for a dive up garden. And we set two purple sectors then. We would have a look down into Vale. But we don't quite, we don't actually sneak up inside into the club when we go. And we set a fastest lap then. Oh, we caught a lot, lots up there into Abbey. This could be the move. We could try maybe take the move into Nuffield, but we get, not the field, the loop even. And the hitting just, just in a little left top and we do spin out a little bit. That's wide open, it's down the into the straight when we go for the fourth time into the left field and Buckland's complex.
and if you did see the Austrian Grand Prix, you will actually see that um, there are very wrong components, but I replaced them with some fresh components, as you can see, even a new gearbox we put, put in. And now the engine is a lot more fresh, so we are taking maximum power then into this in, into our home Grand Prix, and, and it seems that that's really helped us then. And 
Hamilton's in P6 now, and we are in the provisional race lead at the minute. Bear in mind, this is my first season in this, on this game. We've done very, very well. how much the, the, the goes to show how much the track can help around it and it seriously has helped for me it seems please don't time please don't, yes we're in um, we're in the green on fury so we can push to the end
be a warning for court and court and I'll make a mistake. Oh, it's a nice set. I've got a purple set because of that. Oh, Signs has retired from the race. That's a shame for Signs. He was actually in the lead of this Grand Prix at one point. this year but it is probably my favourite win ever we run in Azerbaijan and now we're going to win my home Grand Prix just a few more corners to go until I cross that finish line Here it is then, find another win under our belt. This is only our second ever Grand Prix win. And somehow, you know, after this, I can't believe it. I honestly can't believe it. My home Grand Prix just won the by The faces on our top three look so incredibly happy as they make their way up to the podium. A much deserved victory and a brilliant performance from them all. So there are my faces doing what Lambo Norris did when he got his first ever podium. But now we have two wins under our belt. So yeah. We're about to get a lot of XP from this. I 
we've got tier 13. And now let's take a look at the driver standings. After today's performance, Valtteri Bottas secures the championship lead. So, Anthony Davis. That's the difference. One point. Driver of the day. It's got to be Lewis Hamilton. I mean, he pulled off some impressive feats out on the track today, even by his standards. It's time to see how things are shaping up in the constructors' championship. Mercedes continue to extend their lead. And we are uh... the younger drivers' team this weekend to push themselves further up the order. I'm equal parts exhausted and elated with this weekend of Formula One. Be sure to join us for the next one. So yeah, it's the our home Grand Prix win. But thank you guys for watching. Um, hit, hit that like, comment, and subscribe. Um, thank and again, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. So yeah, there it is guys. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in a brand new video tomorrow. Well, maybe not tomorrow, but... Okay, um, yeah, bye guys.